Ernesto Hoos, the Michael Jordan of K1. Just a taste of what he does to a crowd on the walk-in. Everyone around him was dancing. He just tapped gloves with a spectator. That was the most thrilling thing ever to happen to that person. Ernesto Hoost in the blue and the white trunks. Mr. Perfect from Holland. Jan Yorkke from South Africa in the red flap trunks. Well, we've got what might be the best K-1 fighter of all time. It's really certainly the biggest of all time. I don't know that that will ever come bigger than Nordkid. 6'11", 316 pounds. Already under contract to Don King as well. He's had three boxing bouts. He's 3-0. Ernesto Hoos is not a okay, break, GP break. champion for not knowing how to take on a variety of oncomers. A good leg kick by Hoos. That was heard of the cheap seats. Not much finesse by Norte, but a lot of enthusiasm. A lot of information passed into Ernesto Hoos right then when that missed. <laughs> Make sure it's a miss. <laughs> okay, that's primary. That's the information you need. <laughs> now, good leg kick, but Hoos took a left hand and responded. I'll tell you, Norte has some pretty good counter punching ability. He's quick with the counters. He's also breathing heavily on this. some blood coming out of the nose of Ernesto Hoos. So obviously Norte tagged him at least once. Hoos has taken some punches and Norte has taken a lot of leg kicks on that left leg. That's a, that's a seventh or eighth good kick that Hoos has landed. Norte has left himself open a number of times in this first round. Take advantage. Yeah, an elbow of our Norte, I think, got to the nose of Hoost. So I'm curious if Hoost is going to be a little more tentative here in round number two. Scheduled for five rounds, the super fight is. I think Hoost knows that against someone that big, you've got to conserve your energy. They'll start leaning on Boost, I think, realizes he's got to keep Nortke back. He's got to be able to back him off. Nortke can, can okay, punch. Okay, break! Break! Nortke gave break. a Take cry defense. of, Take come defense. on! Don't After who's just off. thrown a break. combination of techniques in the corner. Well, who's so far has been active, but he hasn't really unleashed from Nortke. Break! Take this in. Break! Nortke break. takes a shot from who's that's, that's got everything who's can put behind it. He's going to find out that, that size... Doesn't always keep matter. Keep okay, break, break, break. Hey. Who's wiping away the blood from his nose as a result of that activity from round one? Keep going, go. Can't push him. He tried to push him away, but Who's could not push North Okay, away. break. He's a break. little bit of leverage break. and 316 pounds uh, feels hey. like. A redwood tree that's been planted for 300 years. Well, and that is a real factor. Uh, these these okay, fighters break, are break, used break. to the landing some punches, getting in close, and pushing the opponent away. And who cannot do that? 
This is going to be a tough five rounds, and maybe that's I'm speaking the obvious for New York Day, but already this man looks like he has had enough. Oh, look at this. Like, oh, is that all you got? I, I think he certainly doesn't have the shape that Hoos does. Keep I don't go, know if New York Day can last five break. rounds at this stage. He's already on. breathing heavy. He just hey. told Hoos, you can't hurt me, but that's not true. Keep going, keep going. Hoos can't hurt him. Just as he was doing in round number one, Ernesto, keep who's go, go. leaving his mark on Take that left sense. leg of Jan Norte. Hey. He's picked out that left leg as being the one he's going to work on, and he finishes almost go, every combination with a kick to that leg, just like that one. Norte not even trying to block. He's just absorbing the kicks. Against Ernesto Hoos, that's a bad idea. What you're going to see is Norte then start to crumple over to protect that leg, open himself up. I wouldn't be surprised if Hoos goes upstairs with a flurry. Okay. And that is the end of round two. It's all in the master plan of Ernesto Hoos. For many counter punches. Right back to the kicks on that leg. Norte is not going to make hold, five rounds on that okay, left break, leg. Break. Okay, don't hold, okay? Each other. Hey. No Where's doubt, Hoos will keep, there you go, he's, he just keeps going at it. As long as Hoos can work on that left leg, Norte isn't going to make it all okay, the way break, through this break, fight. Break, What's right interesting, away. though, Mike, take is take usually, I say usually, not 100% of the time, certainly, but a fighter will attack that front leg of a fighter. Norte in the southpaw position, well, his rear leg, the push-off leg, is the one that's being attacked. And it is black and blue and red and ugly already. Oh, well, now Hoos is working on it. You saw the knee strike to the leg, you saw the punch to the midsection. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep going, keep going. Okay, break, okay? Uh, Norte cannot put much weight on that leg as he goes forward. You see him bend over to try to protect it any way he can. Stops the fight in the third round. Ernesto Hoost is the winner by TKO.